Just trying to stay cool. Not too bad right now. Uh, I didn't record earlier. Uh, I was at the grocery store. Found some shady spots there for a little bit. and Back and forth. Other places I go. Right now I'm at the library. It's a lot of shade here at the library. It's nice. I can go in for a little bit. and Cat's fine. It's nice and cool and breezy. In the shade anyway. And still pretty early in the day yet. So uh, I'll come back uh, later on uh, when we're uh, at another place this afternoon when it starts really getting hot and, and see how it is. So that's what we do when it's hot, you know. We find shade and luckily here in the west coast you know there's not much humidity so as long as you're in the shade it's not too bad and like i said i have fans to run if need be and uh cat's fine she's uh, just hanging out up here sitting there just enjoying herself yeah say hello so that's about it uh, i'll come back to you a little bit later and uh oh we did go to petco and got a new collar. I'll insert a, a little picture here after this. Uh, so, all right, that's it. Well, we're at a park right now. Found a shady spot. A nice breeze going. Cat's doing fine. And uh, haven't had to break out any fans yet or anything. I'll probably put my exhaust fan on here. I just don't want to have it on because of noise but um we'll check back in a little bit later it's getting hot it's about 87 supposed to get to 90 so uh that's all get back to you a little bit later well i'm still at the park and uh there's a nice breeze blowing through the windows we're in the shade it's actually pretty comfortable um but i think uh i'm gonna eventually here move to another spot and uh do a review or talk about my exhaust fan that I have. Um, in another video I showed my uh, Endless Breeze fan that I can put up and run off my power station and so forth, but um, I know there's some van dwellers or people that live in vans, they have these big square, uh, you know, exhaust fans, which are great for the larger vans, but, um, you know, being in a smaller van, I was able to find a smaller exhaust fan and it was a little cheaper and, uh, seems to work pretty good so I know this video is gonna be a bunch of pieces put together and it's probably not gonna be very long but you know it is what it is so we're just staying cool and enjoying the uh, breeze that's coming through here um, let's see the kitty's pretty well Zach zonked out here you can even see her there's a nice breeze coming through, so I move to my next spot. We'll uh, we'll talk about the uh, exhaust fan that I have and put in my van. All right, till then. Well, this is a little different angle than what you're used to seeing from me. Uh, sitting in the back here of the minivan, and uh, it might be kind of noisy. I have the fans running. And you know what? Maybe I'll do a little, uh, a little vacuuming while, while I'm at it here. I gotta do a little. Oh, I'm not gonna do. I'm not gonna do that. I do have this little portable vacuum. Works pretty well, actually. Uh, not great, I had to make an adjustment to it, a modification, as the end broke off, but um, yeah, it's a USB rechargeable vacuum, I'll talk about that another time. But anyways, all this noise, let's uh, cut some noise back here, let me turn this one off, the one I'm going to talk about, this is my uh, exhaust fan here. This is a Max Air exhaust fan, it's just a little, uh, I guess it's like a 6 inch something like that uh, in circumference uh, I think it's uh, brings in 200 cubic feet per minute uh, CFM some 200 something like that 
which is fine in this little minivan and it does help i mean i could probably have a second one and it would work really well have one open and just one coming i don't know one blowing out one sucking in you know but uh it works it works right now and of course right now i got the uh endless breeze fan going right now and uh but again in the shade it's not too bad right now um there's a breeze blowing through the window which is really nice and uh so we're still getting by. So um, let me talk about this uh, Max Air Fan. So yeah, this uh, it's up in the ceiling. I have it mounted. Uh, I had to cut a hole. I had to cut a hole in my van. Uh, that was a big, big thing to do, but I did it. And uh, had a lot of rain this past winter and no leaks around it. I didn't have any leaks. I did it all the way you're supposed to do it. Um, you know, with the, I don't know what it's called sealer you put around and, and then after you put it down and screw it tight and then you go over it with the caulk stuff you know i i'm not getting into all it i'm not this isn't a how-to video i'm just going to talk about it a little bit and that's going to be end of this video but it's one of the other ways that we stay cool and it's helped a lot the circulate air brings air in at night sometimes once it starts getting cool the van might be a little warm i'll just you know, hit the button here and you know, it's bringing air in. It's not overly loud. It's actually kind of nice. I fall asleep to it sometimes. So, but yeah, it works really well. Um, again, it's a Max Air fan. I got it on uh, Amazon. Uh, I think I just searched for small exhaust fans or I don't know. Um, again, I'm not going to put a link or anything because I don't do that right now. Eventually, we'll see. But it works well. It helps, and uh, it's just another way we stay cool. And uh, so I think this will probably be the end of the video. I'll see if I get any other shots of the cat. The cat's just chilling out there. Whoop. Oh, you're gonna be shy now. Look away. All right, well, yeah. This will probably be the end of this video. Not a real long video, but I hope you all enjoy. Hope you're doing well. And if you're in a hot situation, hope you can stay cool. Find places to stay cool. And that's all. Take care.